the returns of reduced convergence, which is now available on Amazon Prime, if you want to check it out. Uh, that was in 2019, where he also produced a short film, Custodian. Um, and both films you starred in as well. How, how different is the experience between showing up to set as an actor and showing up wearing the producer hat as well? I've been lucky enough to work with directors whereby um, it's a collaborative process. Uh, so as an actor, you get, to, you get to have a voice and you get to have a say uh, in, in the way that the whole thing is shot and put together and the design and, you know, uh, 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 and even, you know, down to the set dressing is sort of like, do you think your character would have, you know, these books on the shelf or, or, or do you think you would have this or, you know, what is it, uh, what would they wear today and, and you know, looking through uh, you know, costumes and different shirts and jackets and things like that. Um, and certainly with Steve Johnson on, on uh, Convergence, uh, it was an incredibly collaborative process and he wanted me on board as a, as a producer because he wanted my input on, on, on everything from the, you know, from the plot and the writing uh, and the structure of the, of the script. Uh, down to, yeah, as I said, you know, costume and set dressing and, and particular shots uh, mm -hmm. and acting. Um, it can be tough sometimes because you get too caught up in that sort of stuff and you don't do enough. You then have to remove yourself from that and then get yourself in character and think about the theme that you're actually doing uh, and try and be, you know, in the moment and spontaneous and, and feel all of those things. Um, so it's, it, it can be tough, but it's, I think it's incredibly rewarding most of the time because you have far more skin in the game, effectively. <laughs> Yeah, I have to say congratulations on Convergence because it's not easy to take 10 years off and then, because at least from producing and acting, then come back in with, like you say, with both your hands in the pot making this thing happen. You can't truly flesh out your character. You, It's like you're trying to give all to everybody. You're responsible so, for so many things. So when I find out and I do my research and I figure out that you swept film festivals, a lot of them with this film, to me it's even more, you know, just something that you should be paid homage for because I know how hard it is. So talk about, you know, saying, hey, I don't know what's going to happen with this film, but I'm going to give it my all. I'm going to produce it. I'm, I'm in it. I'm doing everything. And then to see the success that it's had, how rewarding is that? Uh, it's fantastic. I mean, there, 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 isn't, there isn't much of a, of a greater feeling than going to a film festival and, and being awarded uh, best film um, because it's, it's just the most enormous relief that... that you, you find other people who actually really value your work and, and, uh, and the amount of you know, time and effort that, that you put into it. Uh, it's not an easy watch uh, as a film if you, if you want to pick it up on, on Amazon Prime. Um, uh, and I'll let you into a secret, it's another $6,000 movie as well. So um, it's, uh, it's, it's, it was, uh, yeah, it's, it's great to have people just, you know, sort of appreciate your work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, before we uh, wrap up the interview, I just want to remind everyone that's listening to, uh, well, first of all, to thank you to Jeremy for joining us and to check out Convergence on Amazon Prime, uh, check out Following on Amazon Prime. That's the trailer.